Seeing as it's Black History Month, it's it's like apparent to me to be honest because when I was in school and we had Black History Month, we never like I don't really think there was any black history and so to me I feel like I grew up not really caring about it too tough because I never learned anything like my school never taught me anything really and truly about my black History. So I found out about Malcolm X on my own. I found out about a lot of things on Rosa Parks. I found out by watching a film. I found out about a lot of maybe like Martin Luther King. Like schools like always scratch the surface of things, but they don't really teach you anything. And one thing that I don't like is because they don't teach you anything about the real world. I was sitting down the other day, a few days ago, and I was thinking to myself, I was like, what did secondary school actually teach me? Because I saw the point of primary school. Primary school, you kind of just get in your bearings. Like, you're learning responsibility, you're learning how to wake up on time, get yourself dressed, you're learning how to go to school, how just to be responsible, and like, you're just learning. Like, primary school is a learning curve, to be honest. Secondary school, I feel like that is more detrimental to your whole life because that is that that's in between ages that really really matter so when you're learning things it's an easy thing to pick up and to remember what you learn and to carry on for the rest of your life in though in those certain ages but i never really learned anything in secondary school that's really prepared me for real life so like I've just noticed that like schools don't really teach kids reality because my school never taught me nothing to do with reality. My school never taught me about the problems I could face because of the colour of my skin or racism in a workplace or race or discrimination or prejudice in just daily life in general. My school never taught me about the benefit system. Not like I'm on it. I'm not I'm not scrutinising anyone that is, but they didn't. They never taught me that it would be hard to get to get a job. I learned always that like education is key and stuff. But when I think about it, I've never ever needed to use algebra for anything. I've never had to do no decimal or remainder for anything in my life. I've never. I was taught English. I've taught mice and men, anthology, holes, Macbeth, um, all of that. But why wasn't I taught about anything that actually matters in life? Because I don't see what mice and men has done for me being 27. It's really horrible that I've had to go through and I've had to grow up. And I spent five days of my life for five years in an institution that never did me anything. Like, being in secondary school, never, I never learned any life lessons. And I feel like that's what school should really incorporate because there's stuff, we have to deal with things in reality. And that's the one place that you can learn, that you have to learn and you have to pay attention. Even if your mind is not there, if what you're learning is reality and it's really in front of you that this is stuff that you can relate to that you have to go back home. Half of the people that are in school, in my, in my old school, all have kids and a lot of them are on benefits. And like that was probably a life that they thought would have been easier instead of education having it been taught that what the benefit system was, what JSA was, and if people really knew the truth about it, then not so many people would have disregarded education and gone down that route to have a child and to be on benefits and now stuck and to have their lives like that. It would have planned out differently. Like, think about sex. In school, 
all they did was teach us how to put a condom on a banana and basically what chlamydia, HIV, gonorrhea is and that's it, how you get it, that's that the human anatomy, the body, what happens when you're conceiving how contraception maybe works but they, don't, they didn't go about all contraception because only when I got to college I heard that girls can get injections and um, implants and the coil like why aren't people learning that in secondary school in sex education why aren't people learning how a homosexuality in secondary school because it's ultimately that's the one place that it could really be taught from a young age and then it prevents people from being homophobic and for equality to really exist like why wasn't I taught in school that Paki was a racist term why wasn't I taught in school that I would have to face racism? Why wasn't I taught in school what JSA actually meant? What people, where your tax goes, why do we pay tax? Why do you not learn that in maths and sign on and all of this stuff? Like, if they knew what it was like to be on JSA and we actually had someone talk about it and we actually had a couple of lessons learning about it and the demographics and, and what it's like and for people to actually come and talk about what it's like for them to be on benefits how hard it is for them to get a job and the fact that a job center doesn't actually even provide you with a job like there'll be so much do you know how many more people would would be going to college or would be aspiring to work from a younger age so instead of leaving and thinking that it's okay just to be on JSA and then you hear the stories of them having kids and from kids and if never worked they left school and they've been on JSA for the last 10 years or 10 15 years and stuff like that would change because no one would intentionally put their self in that the people would be scared if my parents are sending me to school to learn I don't understand why it should be down to them to teach me what my school should be teaching me and a lot of British schools don't teach black kids about being black and about how hard it is and the trials and tribulations you still have to face with being a darker skin tone schools don't teach you how to love yourself and how to appreciate yourself how to appreciate and not only and value your body know your self-worth this is stuff that I feel like should be installed in people at a young age and because when they when they grow and you get to my age they would be so much more aware of things if you were actually teaching equality the way you should be then I feel like so much things in this world would be prevented that's what British schools ultimately don't do anything for someone of color I understand to today like what the fuck mice and men how I, I got I did that as a GCSE and it infuriates me as I'm talking about it because I don't understand what part of my reality was mice and men. But these are schools, right? And there's people governing these schools and there's people wanting pupils to excel. Excel in bullshit because you, you want your numbers and your school ratings to go up so much about how well you teach and for your school to be classified as prestigious and one of the best schools so you can advertise it for more pupils and more money from the government. But what you are teaching children is shit. So I would honestly like really love to push for people being taught reality and that like some things that you actually have to go through as an adult as a living being of some things that people are going to have to face in reality to be taught at a younger age